Welcome to the Investment Properties for Sale show, folks. Thing is selling at or above list. We are going to provide you guys with complete transparency and education. We take you to the video tour. Won't watch TV, giving it to you straight. Got another cash flowing duplex for you guys today. This one, folks. This one is a very good looking property. Pow! Right there. 3618 Burwald. Cleveland, 44109. Old Brooklyn, baby. Old Brooklyn. I got this bad boy priced at 129.9, and we already have tenants in there, right? We're bringing in 1440. These are some uh, legacy tenants, right? They've been here in this property, uh, managed by Holton Wise for a couple years now, right? We've had this property in our portfolio for many years, and uh, as a lot of people who are following the Cleveland market uh, over the last, let's say, like four or five years, uh, rents have skyrocketed recently, right? So we got these folks in there at 720, right? And the footage you're looking at is uh, what the units looked like prior to tenants being placed in there, right? So 720 uh, does not actually seem as impressive as I talked to you uh, mid-2022 right now, right? But like last year, even 720 was great rent, right? I mean, right now it's probably pushed up to where these units should be fetching at least 800. But uh, at Holton Wise, we do have like a long-standing policy uh, from a strategy standpoint that we don't always like go balls to the wall, gear it to the max in regards to trying to get every dollar out of every tenant. Not that we're not trying to increase investor profitability. We actually don't try to do that uh, to increase investor profitability. What I'm trying to say, what I mean is, right, I feel like a lot of investors out there that like the moment the market rents shift a little bit, they want to go to their tenants and try to gouge them and be like, oh, market rents 800 $80 increase right now, you got to pay $800. What happens more often than not is you create more of an adversarial relationship with the landlord and the tenant than is necessary, and tenants will often move out or turn the unit over uh, more than they otherwise would have, right? This is multifamily investing in C-grade neighborhoods in the city of Cleveland, folks. If you have done any research on this business or watched some of the shows we have here on Holton Wise TV, like the Tenants from Hell show, you would know that as landlords, turnovers, multifamily C-grade properties in Cleveland, turnovers are going to be a part of your life. You are going to deal with your fair share of turnovers. So in my opinion, the landlord that is trying to chase pennies is missing dollars because they're going to lose more money by creating artificial turnovers. So that's why we've left the rents at 720, but there is room for improvement. We like to keep longer-term tenants uh, in the units and, and do smaller increases, right? Because we want to encourage them to stay in the units, right? Because if you have a rental property, folks, and I'm renting it for 720, and you're renting it for 800 and then every year I go up, I don't know, 30 bucks, and every year you go up 60 bucks, and over the course of 10 years I have two tenants and you have four tenants, I made a lot more money than you did, right? So I want you all to think about that. But that said, it's uh, going to be your investment. So if you want to increase up to market rent, 800 is about what these units would fetch for right now. Honestly, maybe you could get that even as high as 850. Uh, dude, the market is just flaming hot right now. But uh, this one is a solid earner, whether it's 720 or 800, right? We're in old Brooklyn. Uh, just so you guys are aware, this particular zip code, 44109, uh, has not yet had all of its properties due for that new landlord-led certification law that Cleveland rolled out a couple years ago. Okay, so what that means is eventually towards the end of 2022, this property will need to be lead certified. For those of you watching my show right now who have never heard of these Cleveland lead certification laws, I want you to click the link below this video after you watch this video. I have a half hour video which will break down the new lead certification process in its entirety for you because it is cumbersome. Uh, it is a little confusing. It is by no means uh, a simple process, but it's brand spanking new and guess what it ain't going anywhere and you as landlords are gonna have to adhere to it it is non-negotiable i know if you're looking through the mls 
you're looking at a lot of properties and you're not seeing any mention of it. That's because a lot of real estate agents and a lot of current property owners don't really know about this process. It's very confusing. I don't think the city did a good job uh, of getting the information out there to those people. But hey, guess what? That's what we do at Holton Wise, okay? The number one thing you need to have at your disposal when you become a Cleveland real estate investor is all of the information. So that's why we start there. As for this property, when we do go through the lead paint certification process, Holton Wise, we lead certified properties all the time. I'd venture to guess we're getting more properties lead certified than anybody else in this current market, given that we have a $75 million portfolio. We're doing a lot of this stuff. This one is going to be no, no problem. It's going to be easy peasy, okay? The two biggest costs investors are facing when they have to get their property certified for the first time uh, are replacing windows with the vinyl windows, right? Because that friction point created by opening and closing the window, that's where a lot of issues come. So if you have the original wood windows, you're getting hammered, right? You got to replace them with vinyl windows. Already been done at this property. And then the other thing, uh, if you got that old wood siding, always a pain point, always an issue. So your, your biggest bill is going to be vinyl siding it. Already done at this property. So in summary, it's going to be easy to be lead certified. Solid C-class neighborhood, old broken. We got hundreds of duplexes just like this in the portfolio. Solid paying tenants, paying a good rate, I believe, was market when, when it was made that amount. Uh, now it's a little bit less than market because the market is so hot. Uh, but this property this is going to be an earner for you for the long term. So if you're interested in making an offer on this property, just shoot my team an email, sales at holtonweiss.com. Let me know, let us know in your email how much you want to offer. And if you're paying cash, include your proof of funds. If you're financing, include a pre-approval letter. And if you're not ready to do that yet, you don't have a lender, we will get you a list of lenders. And if this was kind of cool, you enjoyed this, first time you watched Holton Lights TV, you're thinking about getting into whole, uh, the Cleveland real estate market, but you're not quite ready. Uh, to make a bid on a property like this one, you want to know more about me, my team, working with us one-on-one, -on -one, uh, you could go ahead and just book a free call with us uh, by clicking the link below. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.